y'all. So we are going to open up. I need a knife. Okay. All right. So I am so excited. So, okay. Can't even get it. Okay, let me just do like this. I'm having trouble because I'm too high. They boxed the hell out this shit. light really let's see okay it's not happening how I want it to happen it should be a crime We got it, y'all. So, we have it open. Um, this is the English side right here. It says, made the perfect cocktail. Um, the Bartesian experience, professional mixologists crafted approved cocktails in seconds, sis. So you have your uh, your pods, kind of like the, um, the pods in the uh, Keurig if you have one. Then you can select how you want it, light, strong, regular, and then the cocktail comes out. And they have so many different things that they um, come in. And they also have a subscription as well. Oops. Okay, so we have all of this. Um, okay, got that. Congratulations. You are the proud new owner of a Bartesian Premium Cocktail Mixer. Um, it says, get the most out of your new cocktail mixture. Register online to take advantage of exclusive cocktails, promotions, and updates. Um, and then here is the manual. Four of these tubes, one for tequila, gin, rum, um, vodka, and whiskey. Now, I don't really like gin. I don't really like gin that much like that. I will drink it occasionally, but I don't really fool with it like that, so I'm gonna definitely put rum in mine because I really love rum. All right, y'all, we back. I had to wash all of these and the nozzles and all that stuff. And I also washed the water reserver as well. Um, so now we're getting ready to fill our liquor. The first one is, I think this is vodka. Is this vodka? Yes, the first one is vodka. And we're gonna use that Grey Goose. Now remember, if do this is for people 21 and over. If you're not 21 and over, please don't drink and please don't drink and drive as well. So we're gonna use Grey Goose first. And we're just gonna fill it up. Oh, oh. Oh my God, why? Okay, clearly I can't pour. So I'm gonna fill it up because I'm gonna be going to the liquor store today, later today to restock and also get some more stuff. So I'm just gonna fill it up to the top because this is the only, the only vodka that I um, this is the only vodka that I really um, use when I'm mixing my drinks. Okay, because Grey Goose, like I don't know what it is. This is right, right? I don't know what it is, but Grey Goose mixes so well with everything. Like you can't even taste the liquor. So. I always use that when I'm mixing drinks. Now, if I'm just drinking it or taking shots, I like any type of vodka at that point because I'm a vodka. Like, that's my go-to drink. I love vodka. 
So I can pretty much drink any type, any other type of vodka. But when I'm mixing drinks, I'm going to be using that uh that Grey Goose because it's so smooth and you could put so much in there and not even taste it. So the next we're gonna do is gonna use this Spice Rum by Captain Morgan. Now the other one, the spot for this, it has gin and rum. Like I said earlier, I don't really drink gin. I have it, a, I've had it a couple times, but I am not a gin type of person. I much rather, oh my goodness, I much rather have rum any day. All right, so we're gonna close this one, get some more to the towel because your girl just keep on wasting so much. I guess, I think it's cause I'm so excited about this. Put that on there. Make sure I twist it good. Oh, cause that vodka one was not twisted. So I got my vodka and my rum. The next one is tequila. Now my favorite tequila is any tequila because honestly I love tequila. Um, I had a bad, uh, me and my husband went with another one of our couple friends, one of my good girlfriends, and we were celebrating her husband's birthday and me and him were going back to back on shots. We finished a full, big old size 1800 and I haven't been able to drink tequila since. Like I was so messed up. But I do like tequila, so it doesn't really matter what tequila I uh, doesn't. I don't really have a, a favorite, but this is the brand that I'm using today, and we are out of that. So I'm gonna have to go buy more because I'm out of my rum now and I'm out of my tequila. I still have a little bit of Grey Goose, but I do need to get some more. So I'm gonna put this on here. And if you do decide to get this. What I'm doing is opening up this right here because it's plastic and it um it does close up over a period of time. So I'm just making sure that it's open so that whenever I get ready to make a drink, it doesn't, you know, it actually takes the liquor from it. So just a little FYI if you do decide to get this as well. So we got a tequila and last but certainly not least is whiskey. Now, I'm not really a big whiskey fan, you know, so we're going to use this. I do love this Tennessee whiskey. Um, I had Maker's Mark, but like I said, I'm not really, oh damn. Ah. I'm gonna have to go run this in some water because that is closed too tightly. Not really a big whiskey fan at all other than the Tennessee whiskey. Other than that, negative. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go run this in some water. Okay, y'all, we back. So I ran under some hot water and we're good to go. All right, y'all, so now we're just gonna put everything where they go. So the vodka goes here. Oh, snap, it's supposed to be coming out like that. Ah! Oh, I don't think you're supposed to, yeah. In a mess today. All right, so the vodka goes there, and it just, it just, it clicks in. You don't have to twist it or anything like that. Um, the rum goes back here, rum and gin. Let me make sure I'm cleaning that up. Don't want no. All right, so we got the rum and gin now. The next one is the tequila which goes back here. And then the whiskey, which goes right here. So we have our drinks in there. Next is we're gonna put some water in the water uh, reserver. The water reserver is back here at the back. We're gonna fill that up. Now I use water like bottled water like it doesn't matter bottled water i never even even in my keurig i always use bottled water i do not use um tap water so we're just gonna fill that up that's one bottle oops and then the line i know you can't see the line you might can see it a little bit you might can see that line a little bit 
is right there. So we're just gonna fill that line up. I'm sorry, I'm trying to hold this with one hand. There we go. All right, so I think I just need one more bottle. It filled up, I think it filled up with two and a half bottles of water of your traditional amount. Yeah, two, oh, almost two and a half, almost. I had that much left in another half bottle. So about two, I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> that's that. So now we're going to put the top back on it like this. And we are good to go, y'all. We have our rum right here. We have our vodka right here. This is the little mat, which can be removed to clean. We have our whiskey right here and our tequila and our water reserver back here. Now, another thing that I really like about this is that they said that after each time you use it, it automatically, like, it self-cleans. So, you know, the water will go through, the water will go through and, you know, clean itself. So, now we're gonna remove the top part off this. Mm -hmm. Ah, so satisfying, just like I opened up an iPhone. Okay, so now we got that straight. So now we're gonna open this, and that is where the pods go. Now, these are the pods. These are the pods that I got. I got the classic collection, which is just your standard collection. It has whiskey, sour, margarita, old fashioned, Long Island iced tea, a cosmopolitan, and uptown rocks. Now, on the site, you can go buy these individually, or you can, they have a ton of different packs like this that you can get, but I signed up for the, um, for the, um, I signed up for the monthly subscription and they send, um, I think you have a choice of eight, six, six, eight, and something else. I don't know. You have to go on the site, but they have a ton of options for their subscription package and they send it to you every month, uh, same time every month. And then that way you have, you know, you never run out of pods and things like that. And you can also purchase them individually. So now we're going to open this. All right. So I, I definitely think it's worth it to get the subscription box because that way, you know, you don't have to sit there and order it and remember to order it and order one by one. And it gives you a chance to actually try each you know thing that they have to offer and and they have a low calorie um a low calorie section so like if you like me and you want a lifestyle change and you're watching your sugar and you're watching all this they have low calorie margaritas and cosmopolitan like and all of that i just it just offers a lot so this is what it looks like when you open it up have the long island iced tea the whiskey sour the margarita the cosmopolitan the uptown rocks and the old-fashioned now i do plan on getting like a little cute basket to put my um, pods in, but I haven't got that yet. I'll probably get that later on today. If so, I'll put, insert which one I got into the video. Okay, y'all, we are all done with my coffee slash tea slash wine slash alcohol nook. I am so excited. Um, 
I do have some more wine bottles to get. Um, I have a wine refrigerator in my office, but those are only the, the wines that are supposed to be um, refrigerated. So these are the ones that are not. Um, I do plan on putting some more like decor up here. I don't know exactly what I'm gonna put, but I'm gonna figure something out. I am gonna put some more decor right here. Don't know yet, but I'll find it as I go. And as for right here is where my uh, bowl is gonna go whenever I get my uh, pods, which I'm on my way to go get right now. So I'm putting my pods where that is. So what we all been waiting for is to make our drinks, sis. So, we gonna do a cosmopolitan because we bougie like that. So I took a pot out already, which is the cosmopolitan, and you just put it like this. It goes exactly how it's shaped, and then you close it. But you make sure you hear that click. You have to make sure you you know close it. Um, so it says place shaker with ice under the dispenser. No, no need, no need for that. Next, so. They have mocktail, light, regular, and strong. Um, I, just for trying it out, I like strong stuff, okay? I like, honestly, it depends on what mood I am. I may want a mocktail someday. Sometimes I might want light, regular. Some days I want strong. So we're just gonna press the regular and then we are going to mix it and they're taking from the vodka, it looks like. Oh, yes. I have to go get me some garnishes and things like that. Um, oh, yes. Bougie b Okay. Is it done? Almost. Yes, it says cheers, open the lid and remove the capsule. So we're gonna make sure we remove the capsule. Okay. And it's completely empty. So, and it cleans itself out and things like that. Periodically I will go through and you know, clean it myself. Um, so, oops, here is our Cosmopolitan.